Okay guys, tonight I am on the square in Dover, Ohio and it is finally, finally lit up. If you guys remember, I've been out here a couple of times to see these lights. I thought they were going to be lit up when I was out here before, and they weren't, but they are finally tonight. I think they finally had their lighting ceremony a couple weeks ago, and I'm just now getting back out here. So let me show you all this lit up. First of all, look at the police station over here with the bells on it. <laughs> I don't know how well this is coming in, but those are green and red alternating Christmas bells on the police station there. That is actually pretty cool. Then as you come over here, we got like some lit up trees and the carolers and stuff. We'll actually go over there in just a minute, but I think we'll start on this side tonight. And we got the carolers behind me over here. I don't know if I can, hold on. There we go, that picture's a little bit better. That looks pretty cool actually. That is all like wooden cutouts up there. Look at the stained glass behind them. <laughs> That's funny. And they're actually in front of a church over here. I really like all these uh, illuminations, whatever the heck you call those. I can't think of what you call them. But they're buckets. They're all lit up and they go all the way around here. All the way back. And then, of course, if you look across the street, they're all over there, all the way down that road over here on this corner and all the way down. And they're also on this corner over here. Look, it's just a bucket with a light bulb in it. I can't even imagine what it costs to have all this lit up. <laughs> Let's go over here though, across the street and we'll, uh, we'll work our way around because I'm gonna show you guys all this stuff. Look, we got wreaths and garlands with bells across the street. And going all the way down that street there. 11, 10, 9, 8. Okay, we made it. I was standing over there pushing the button for the longest time to try to get the walk signal. <laughs> I don't even know if that thing works. I think that's just a trick you and make you feel better about crossing the street. Here we got Santa and, well, four reindeer and a couple of elves. Maybe they wrecked. Maybe they lost the rest of the reindeer and these elves are looking for tracks. <laughs> I do see a Christmas tree in this window over here of this shop, so I want to go check this out real quick. Lori Brown Interior Design. That looks pretty cool right there, though. Awesome. All right, let's make our way over here. I see the nativity scene across the street is all lit up and a pile of giant ornaments. I wish the curtains weren't pulled on this. We could see the uh, the Christmas decorations a little bit better. What is this? The Country Mouse Crafts and Bulk Foods. Okay, cool. Look how they have the garlands and the lights all the way down the street here. That looks really cool. Here we go again. Pushing the fake button. It's not even a real button, you just touch it, listen. I don't know if you can hear that or not. Oh, we got the green walking guy. Oh crap, the countdown started. Here we go, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, nine, eight, sorry person in a car. <laughs> they were not happy because I was crossing the street. <laughs> People are so crazy, man. Like, what are you in such a hurry for that you get mad at somebody crossing the street? Here's our giant Christmas ornaments. All right, I gotta set the phone down and show you how big these are. Look at this, they're taller than me. Okay, here is our nativity scene over here. That's lit up pretty good. I saw a story online about a dog that somebody like abandoned and it found a warm place to lay in the, uh, the little bed with baby Jesus in a local nativity scene. That looks pretty good. Okay, I'm just really curious if these are like... Uh... Yeah, that's like a hard resin. 
These are pretty good looking figures though. And one more time. Push the button that doesn't exist. <laughs> it looks pretty good to stand here in one place and look around the square here. Everything is lit up really awesome. That's where we're headed next, right over there. All right, it ain't getting any warmer standing here waiting. Okay, finally made it across. I am so cold, guys. It is so freezing out here. Look at the carolers. Reminds me of a Norman Rockwell painting. We got the Christmas trees in the background. It would be really cool if they had like an ice skating rink over here, but I know they don't. But let's take a walk over this way. Because I like the way that they have all these buckets lit up all around the perimeter over here. There's our Christmas Bells police station there. Giant Christmas trees. But look at this, that looks kind of strange. Well, no, it looks totally different on, on the video here. But to me in person, it's just a silhouette of the carolers. And it looks really creepy. <laughs> But yeah, look at this over here. I believe this is a fountain. Yeah, well, it's just bubbling right now, but... But look at that, they got the... the buckets all the way around. And up over the fountain, that's pretty cool. There's Santa's house over there. All right, let's go check that out, I'm freezing. I swear my fingers are just about to drop off holding this camera. Yep, here we go. And look, a lot of these are multicolored over here. That looks pretty cool. Santa's house up here. Actually, not a whole lot to see there, but I bet Santa is like inside that house. He's probably sleeping right now in there. <laughs> I wouldn't mind going in there right now, it's so cold. There's our giant snowman, like on Christmas with the Cranks. And that tree, I'm not trying to put it down, but I honestly expected it was gonna look a lot bigger once it was lit up. But these trees over here actually look bigger than that one. Look at that. Look at the whole place lit up here. That looks so cool. I just wish it were snowing right now. Not because I want it to be colder. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's keep on moving over here. We got one more thing to look at, and that's these wooden cutouts over here of all the cartoon characters. Okay, here we go. We got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Michelangelo and Donatello, Pepe Le Pew, the Smurfs. Ooh, we got a whole bunch of Smurfs. <laughs> There's Brainy on the end. Pink Panther, Tasmanian Devil, and uh, Tom and Jerry. And then what do we got over here? Uh, Bugs Bunny, the Roadrunner, Wiley Coyote, the Flintstones, Porky Pig, and Raphael. Wait a minute, we're missing one of the uh, one of the turtles. Oh my gosh, I'm so cold, I can't even think. Okay, got Michelangelo, Donatello, Raphael, and who's the other one? My brain is frozen. I cannot believe I cannot even think of the name of the missing turtle. What the heck? Oh well, you guys tell me what his name is. I just can't even think right now because it's so cold. My fingers are about to fall off. So I'm getting out of here. One last look at the Christmas goodness here in Dover, Ohio. Maybe, just maybe, I will come back and film it one more time when it is actually snowing out here. For now, I'm getting in a warm car and heading home. I'll see you guys later. Peace.